And now Storm Tracker weather with meteorologist Michael Ottovino. Starting off the work week with some snow across the storm tracker radar indicated it looks like it's falling currently across the Idaho Falls area. Also some snow showers to the south. So if you are traveling for this morning along the I-15 Malad Pass, definitely take it a bit slower out there. And we will see some of the snow showers gradually make their way across most of the Snake River Plain throughout the morning. The good news is once the snow passes through throughout the morning hours, we will see some clearing for the Snake River Plain later on this afternoon. Temperatures out there this morning in the 20s and the 30s. We're at 25 degrees across Idaho Falls, 34 in Pocatello, 27 across Jackson. Areas to the north are a bit cooler. What you can expect for this week it will definitely be an interesting week, so to speak, out there. Snow does return for today across all of the Snake River Plain. We will see some snow showers during the morning, again, some clearing during the afternoon hours. And then for this week, it is Thanksgiving on Thursday. Do expect holiday travel delays. We're expecting snow almost every day this week. I think the best day for any traveling will definitely be for tomorrow. We'll get a slight break, but for the rest of the week, especially Wednesday afternoon, we will definitely see some snow across the Snake River Plain. Also, perhaps a more measurable snow for about the Friday into the Saturday time frame. But regardless, even on Thanksgiving, we will see some snow showers that will make traveling very slick. Give yourself plenty of time and also plan alternate routes, especially if you do plan on traveling to some of the higher elevations across the western half of Wyoming, also to the Central Mountains as well. And again, more snow throughout the week. Chances of snow persist pretty much every day for this week as well. Storm Tracker satellite radar again giving you a wider view. Cold front out to our south that did pass through. So this morning we're in the 30s. Tomorrow morning when you wake up, temperatures will be in the single digits and also in the teens. And again, we are getting the wraparound snow that will be making its way into our area. Those snow showers to the south. Those will move across the western half of Wyoming. Stay scattered throughout the day. So also throughout the afternoon across some of the mountain passes for western Wyoming. Do expect some slick travel out there. But locally across the Snake River Plain, we will see those sh snow showers this morning that will give way to mostly cloudy skies with a few peaks of sunshine for this afternoon. High temperatures today, much cooler than yesterday, only in the 30s. We'll be at 37 today in Idaho Falls, 36 in Rexburg, 38 today across Pocatello. For the Central Mountains, scattered snow showers in the forecast. Temperature is very similar to slightly cooler than the Snake River Plain in the 30s. 36 across Salmon, 35 across Chalice, 30 today for Mackey and for the Highlands in western Wyoming. Scattered snow showers expected throughout the day. Especially be aware of slick spots on roadways. Give yourself extra time when traveling for today. High temperatures in the 20s and the 30s. Now, timing out this moisture fuse, 7 o'clock this morning again. That band of snow showers making its way south across the Snake River Plain, right around 9 o'clock across American Falls. So, traveling along the I 86 and also the I-15 southbound. You'll definitely encounter slick roadways as well. And once I put it in motion, 1 o'clock this afternoon, we will see some sunshine out there. The snow showers again scattered throughout western Wyoming. Also for the Central Mountains, we could see very isolated snow showers later on this afternoon, around 4 o'clock across American Falls. But then again for this evening, across the Snake River Plain, partly cloudy, we could see a few snow showers linger for the Central Mountains and the western half of Wyoming. But as expected, temperatures tonight. Much cooler for the Snake River Plain. Teens for the lower plain, upper plain, slightly cooler in the western half of Wyoming. Some areas tonight dropping into those single digits. Your Southeast Idaho Chevy dealers seven day forecast leaves us with a partly cloudy sky for tomorrow. Snow showers expected for the middle of the week throughout the rest of the week as well. Idaho Falls snow showers this morning, partly cloudy tomorrow. Lots of snow showers on the way for the rest of this week. Teton area snow showers expected today. A few more tomorrow than more moderate snow for the rest of the week and for the Central Mountains. Snow showers today, a break from any snow tomorrow.